Mr. It, T, it, yes. we, 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 Naman Kush, yeah. uh, you are both preachers. Yes. But I've listened to both of you, mm. but kuna a lot of difference in how you guys preach. <laughs> One, Man Kush, I've heard too casually, uh, as in, I've heard of God. Mm -hmm. Straight up, Man Kush, I've heard of God. Yes, I've heard of God. I've heard of God. I've heard of God. Unasikia? Yeah. Kwanza, hata vita, wache kumpigania, hata vita yake na shetani, mi singiri yagi. So, we uke meyangi shetani? Tunaulizana nina nine shetani. Simi na hita yesu dia wanawezana. <laughs> Manku, uh, yeah. Mr. T. Yeah. Uh, ni wote, first of all, ni wote mume ituwa na mtu mmoja? Na, na, yona is a backup. Kuna Ephesians 4.11. Mm. Inasema, wakati yesu wali ascend, yes. alipatia gifts to men. Yes. Na kasema some apostles, some prophets, some teachers, some evangelists, and some pastors. It's called yes. fivefold ministry. The fivefold. Sazo na kutakwa ah. fivefold, ni kama neema iko juu ya mankush, ni tofauti sana nenye iko juu yangu. Na yon neema ndu ina dictate kazi yenye nafanya. So, so wewe uko kwa department ya shetani, as in kudimina shetani. Vila jua... Don't ne... put words in his mouth. <laughs> okay, sawa. Na jua neema iko juu yangu, eh, ni more of apostolic. Okay. Na apostolic ina kuanga na level ya governance, na teritorio. Sasa mimi ni kiso ma Bible na yangali yanga from that level. Ju, yondi wa kazi ya apostles, kiangali ya Paul and okay. all that. Ni kiangali ya mtuka pasi, mankush. Naeza tell, he's a shepherd, ni pasi. Yaya kona welfare watu, watu wana grow kwa imani, watu wana jua mungu na personal level na nando hiyo. Sasa ndo mano na kutanga. Unaza tupe the same scripture, ye vile ataihubiri, atakuwa with the heart of a shepherd. Okay. Mivile nita ihubiri, nita kuwa na the perspective ya apostle. So we are still preaching the same thing, same sender, but different assignments and different roles. So kama mtu wa megro wakienda kwa chachi ya mankush, na mtu wa megro kwa mtu wakienda kwa chachi yako, they are getting two very different things. At the end of the day, ita kuwa ni one, one message. Si wate to appoint kwa Christ, to appoint kwa forgiveness of sin, to appoint kwa redemption. Yes. So ni vile tu assignment. Ni kasa ome ka hapo ka... Dr. Kengori, after that, mtuwa new sata kam. Yes. The same office, same employer, but yes. different roles. Ah. So, utakuta, we, we job yako, eh, ndiyo unasoma news, na kuna information unapass, but through comedy. Na we, kuna ule sasa lazima kwe serious, <laughs> kizungu, kila Nandie. kitu. Akisiniza, ah. atasema, sorry, wone za siniza na ucheke, na ikani joke. Ah. So, so, ni hivo, ni otu kwelewa, kuna different jobs. That's why siyezi ingili yaktu wanadu, kwa sababu, job description yake ni different na yangu. So I just need to celebrate. In short, na... unaweza kof, akwambie, bless you. <laughs> na mimi ukikof, ni kwambie, nugui unataka kutuwa. Taza, <laughs> 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 manikush. Na, na mtu wanajuaji hameitua kwa gani? <laughs> mtu wanajuaji hameitua kwa gani? Unadipend vile uliitua. Kuhita wa ni mi... <laughs> Wewe hivyo ndio wewe uliitwa. Wewe uliitwa aje? No, si kuitwa hivyo. <laughs> <laughs> no. Why do you want to know how I was called? No, no, I didn't ask to know how you were called. Mm -hmm. Okay, basi, how do you know you have been called? It is because you are working together with the caller. You are having personal relationship with the one who calls. So mimi naweza kuwa pastor na sijui. You unaweza kuwa pastor. For example, there is something this guy said one day and I was watching something. Kuna pastor wamefanya kanisa industry. Uh -huh. Na kuna pastor ambao wamefanya kanisa ministry. ministry. Uh -huh. Na both all of us we are, we are pastors. Sasa mukisema, oh ma pastor munataka pesa, you are speaking the truth because wako. Mm. Na kuna wengine kazi yao ni kushepu watu diyo have reached the destiny. Okay. Now I'm, I'm part of those. Kwa sabu siyo lazima urichi destiny, ukwe umeka kama huko kwa maomborezi. Mhm. Mm Kwa hivyo diyo lazima mimi ni kifundisha, lazima watu wacheke na walie. Okay. You get me? Uh -huh. So that they get, they get exactly what I mean with, with the word which is coming from me. So kwa injili we ni mwalimu wa physics? Uh, I, 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 can, <laughs> I, can, I can go in an office, mm. but I know my office. Okay. Na, <coughs> waja, waja ni jibu wapo pa calling, eh? Calling ina kuanga ni burden. It's a burden. That's what akuta mtu wakona genuine call, akuangi na objective ya personal benefit. Ju, wakati, that's what I could have, most of the pastors when you alianza genuinely, walitumia dozao, ukikachini na mawaifuwa utasikia, kuna ploti tuliuzanga ndio tujenge church. Mm -hmm. Hawaku wanafikiri wa shiriki watakaa mtuludishe do. Kama so, mimi. So, iyo baden. Wewe ufikiri ya wa shiriki. Niliuza, wa... niliuza gari, mm. diyo nijeke kanisa githurai. That's where I started. So, iyo baden, iyo baden, haikuangi juu ya benefits. Mm. 
-hmm. Lakini sasa kuna watu wameangalia juu leta ukianza kuwa na Mungu kuna vitu zinaweza kuwa passive tika benefit. Mm -hmm. Mdu anaweza kuwa na prado leo lakini umetuma nguo preach Mandera Marsabit. So ni kifo by four kia kufika huko. Yes. But kuna msee prado ni luxury. Yana angalia e eh, umza etu li hustle na e. Eh. Sea kwa ujujua kifo by four. Na ya mweni aji wata atamini anzishe ka kangu. But ye yeah, objective yake haikuwa ni, ni haikuwa uh -huh. calling. Uh -huh. e, na unajua nga msee na calling time ya challenges. Unona kasa hizi na hii COVID. Sa hii ndio mwenye liitana ndo anachugulikia watu wake. 